the type of business or service you provide. Let me make sure there's a code for it, okay? A code for prostitution? Dancing. Dancing is considered an art. Sex is kind of like dancing, right? Yes. A new generation of conservatives. Hannah Giles and James O'Keefe. They dressed up as a prostitute and a pimp to expose Acorn. Don't worry, you're fine. Lila Rhodes. And still well, recording, praise God. She's an anti-abortion activist who poses undercover at Planned Parenthood clinics around the country. Check out the back. It's, it's filming you right now. They were burned at the stake. They were shot for what they believed in. Right. What are we going to do? Christian Hartsock works in Hollywood and directs films with a conservative message. Freeze! How far do you think young conservatives will go to expose the truth? As far as we need to. Jason Matera. Hey, Senator Franken. Confronts liberal lawmakers in the hallways of Congress. Why don't you mind your goddamn business? No, I'm serious. You have to shut up right now. And Ryan Sorba. You guys like water? Pepsi Zero, water from a bigot? He's an anti gay activist, not afraid to stir up controversy. The sodomy is wrong, it's immoral. And it seems to follow him wherever he goes. Wait, do you hate Christianity? I do not hate Christianity. What you do it. Then why are you yelling at me like that? Armed with video cameras, ideas, and the internet, it's a new wave of good old-fashioned guerrilla journalism. Who do you represent? Many call themselves investigative journalists, reporting on stories they feel others are too afraid to report. Abortion will end. Disappointed and angry, they say the mainstream media let them down. So they've decided to do the job themselves. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Hannah Giles. And they are rock stars of the movement. I love you guys so much, you have no idea. And perhaps James, the most secretive of them all, would end up revealing the most about himself when he tried to turn the cameras on us. Hey, Dan, do you hate Christians? They're controversial. Did you notice you haven't answered my question? And confrontational. And that's the way they like it. They are right on the edge. Wish pan over here. Steady cam up to him as he stands up. What's that sound? Freeze! Get against the car! And then swish pan back over to James. I'm a filmmaker who's passionate about movies, who's passionate about art, and I happen to be a conservative. For months, we documented Christian Hartsock. The uh, disco lights come on. A young conservative trying to make it big in Hollywood. Zooming in, zooming out, boom. Today, he's prepping for a music video he's directing. I love steady cam. At first, he wouldn't tell us much about the video he's making, but he did tell us James O'Keefe is starring in it. Turns out, James is a good dancer. He made a cameo in one of Christian's other music videos. James O'Keefe, arguably one of the most prominent people in the young conservative movement, has been busy the past couple of years. First, he made headlines with the Acorn Undercover Project. But his next big idea, months later, fell short and landed him in jail. James accompanied colleagues disguised as phone repairmen and entered Senator Mary Landrieu's office. They wanted to see if the senator was ignoring her constituents' phone calls about concerns over the health care bill. His sting backfired. He pleaded guilty to a misdemeanor, and he's been on probation since. Do you have anything to say about the charges against you? Please. She'll set me free. We would learn the new music video Christian Hartsock is directing is where James O'Keefe is set to make his comeback. It's a big diss to liberal media, law enforcement, and the government. I don't necessarily want um, to change people's minds. I'd rather turn heads and get people talking. My job is to make provocative content. You're gonna say, get against the car! All right. And he does that with controversial people. 
Ryan Sorba is rehearsing the part of an FBI agent in the music video. First of all, um, there is a scene where Mary Landrew is going to be here. She's going to be freaking out on She's us. She's going to be freaking out like... Okay, cool. Well, I mean, and then can you tell you, a little I, bit about the tea party? We first met Ryan at a meeting for young conservatives in California. Christian introduced us. I've heard you guys all kind of like moan and groan about liberal media. What's what's so wrong? I mean, what, first of all, do you view CNN as liberal media? Yes. Okay, so what's it like to have me sitting right here? Are you, what are you thinking? The Communist News Network. I feel like I'm under fire right now. I feel afraid a little bit. When you're watching... Um, well, I don't watch CNN or MSNBC except for once in a blue moon. At age 28, Ryan Sorba is the oldest young conservative we've met. I'm Ryan, nice to meet you. He invited us to a Chicago suburb for an anti-gay event called Americans for Truth Academy. A rising star of the conservative movement, and he hasn't sold out on homosexual activism, Ryan Sorba. He's one of the speakers and wants to promote the book he's writing, The Born Gay Hoax. It's a psychological disorder, and a psycholo what does psyche mean? Psyche means soul. It's disorder of the soul, of the nature of man. Some in the movement tell us he's extreme. Yet, like the others, he's not afraid to speak his mind and push his views, even if it offends people. There is absolutely no scientific evidence for this notion that people are in some way born, quote, gay. He's best known for this one-minute rant at a conservative conference. I'd like to condemn CPAC for bringing Go Pride to this event. He denounced conservatives for allowing gays to attend. I love it. What do we want? After the speech outside Chicago. What do we want? Equal rights. When do we want it? Now. A group of gay rights protesters is ready to take Ryan on. And Ryan is ready. Do you guys hate Christians? No. No? Then why are you protesting a Christian church for promoting their most fundamentally held beliefs? You want to put us in gas chambers, mother No, we don't. Gay yeah, deals. Do you hate Christians? You then why are you yelling at me like that? This is the definition of tolerance right here. Ideological diversity in action. Right wing bigots, go away. Keep smiling all the way. Ryan Sorba continues to promote his views on what he calls the born gay hoax. All right, we're taking off. This guy's making no sense. What's the nature of the reproductive organ in act? It's reproduction. He speaks around the country and plans to someday soon finish writing his book. Switch in.